हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो सेशन वी विल डिस्कस द कंसेप्ट ऑफ एडजुवेंट सो एडजुवेंट्स आर द सब्सटेंसेस व्हिच इंक्रीजेस द इम्यूनोजेनिसिटी ऑफ द एंटीजन सो बिफोर गोइंग टू द कंसेप्ट ऑफ एडजुवेंट वी मस्ट नो द कंसेप्ट ऑफ इम्यूनोजेनिसिटी immunogenicity of the antigen is its ability to produce immune response when it is injected to the animal and it depends upon the many factors like size of the antigen the dose of the antigen its biochemical composition genotype of recipient animal and many more other factors and therefore every antigen differs in immunogenicity some antigens are more immunogenic in nature than the others if antigen with very low immunogenicity is injected to the animal it will produce very poor immune response and maybe immunological memory may not be generated against it such a low immunogenic antigen when mixed with the chemical called as adjuvant and then injected to the lab animal their immunogenicity is drastically increased and therefore many vaccines which are inactivated antigenic preparations are mixed with the adjuvants you might be thinking now that how this adjuvants increases the immunogenicity of the antigen well different types of adjuvant uses the different mechanisms for the same for example aluminum potassium sulfate better known as alum precipitates the antigen and due to this antigen is very slowly released from the site of injection this increases the contact effective time and antigen presentation becomes effective precipitation also increases the size of antigen which enhances the phagocytosis process friends incomplete adjuvant contains antigen in aqueous solution mineral oil and emulsifying agent such as the mannite monoolate in this case the small droplets of oil are produced which are surrounded by the antigen in this case also antigen is released very slowly from the site of injection the composition of friunds incomplete adjuvant and friunds complete adjuvant is nearly same but friunds complete adjuvant has an additional component and it is the heat killed mycobacteria the mycobacteria contains muramyl dipeptide in its cell wall and this component of the cell wall activates the macrophage activated macrophage express the high level of msc class 2 molecule as well as the p7 molecule and due to this high expression of these two molecules the antigen presentation is enhanced alum and both the type of friunds adjuvants are known to stimulate the inflammation process at the site of injection due to inflammation a large number of macrophage and lymphocytes are attracted at the site this again enhances the antigen presentation process and increases the speed of immune response in short adjuvants either precipitate the antigen and increases its size and prolongs its persistence or it activates macrophage and enhances phagocytosis and increases the expression of msc class 2 and b7 molecule which is also known as co stimulatory signal or few adjuvants stimulate the local inflammation process hope you understood the concept of adjuvants If you like this video please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you will receive a notification whenever I will post such video thank you very much and have a nice day